Damian Lewis from Prep Sports Nation here at Creekside High School in Fairburn, Georgia for some high school football Friday Night Lights action. What a matchup tonight. Big rivalry game between the Creekside Seminoles and the Westlake Lions. And it would be Creekside coming up on top. 27-20, your final score thanks to Nikoi Lett connecting with Derek White in the end zone late in the fourth quarter, giving them the lead. And then the defense coming up big for the Seminoles really late in the fourth quarter, stopping Westlake on a fourth and fourth team inside the 20. Let's check out some of the highlights. Both defenses going to work early. Opening drive for Westlake here on a fourth down. They'll come up short because the Seminoles defense taking RJ Johnson down in the backfield. And then later on, it's going to be the Westlake defense getting after the quiet let as he goes down after he's forced to scramble, turnover on downs. But then the Seminoles offense going to get going here. Let connecting with Jerome Harris. And Harris bringing it inside the 20 before he's taken out of bounds. And then later, it's going to be Cameron Birch taking the hand off up the middle and gets the push for the score Seminoles on top first six nothing to score more from that Seminoles defense here it's gonna be Dacius Miller coming up with a big hit here making sure Westlake doesn't come up with that catch and then later on Javion Miller coming right up the middle stopping that run right in the backfield another big hit from that Seminoles defense and then here comes more from the offense this time it's going to be Kamari Davis with a big hole to go through as he scores 12 nothing the lead for the Seminoles at the half third quarter Westlake knows they need to get things going so RJ Johnson dropping back and finding Caden Lee for a big first down catch and then Johnson and Lee are going to connect one more time and this time Lee hauling it in inside the five setting up a first down first and goal and it's going to be the Lions scoring thanks to Jaden Thomas who had a big game on the ground for the Lions Westlake on the board they trail 12-7 fourth quarter early in the period it's going to be Thomas again his second score of the night and as I said he'd have a big game on the ground for the Lions but back the other way here comes the Seminoles it's let to Birch and Birch to let let goes up and gets it comes down with it and then on the same drive let fakes out the whole Westlake defense and he's going to easily score and it's going to be Creekside back on top 20 to 13 so back the other way here comes Westlake and it's going to be Thomas another big run from here shaking the defender there and then here just going to bulldoze his way all the way inside the five yard line and then Johnson taking the handoff and he's just going to keep and go right up the gut bouncing off those Seminoles players into the end zone for the score we're all tied up 20 apiece with 228 to go so back the other way under two minutes to go let Forced to scramble to his right, and he's going to find Derek White in the corner of the end zone for the score. Creekside back on top, 27-20. They're rocking in the swamp, but it's not over. Westlake with under 20 seconds to go, taking a shot, and it's intercepted by Ricky McCrary, and that's going to be your game. Here's Coach Maurice Dixon on the win and the play of his defense. We just came out here and played Creekside football. That's just being physical, playing fast, flying around. You know, no negative plays, no penalties. And at the end, we got a shot to win. We always treat the coming out of the half as the game is zero to zero. Mm -hmm. You know, we are a second half team. We play better in the second half. So I expected us to come out here and play better. We kind of came out here and made some stupid mistakes on that first drive. And we had something going that kind of backed us up. But we just kept fighting and we was there in the end. I mean, Creekside has traditionally had good defenses. We're a defensive led football team. As they go, we go. All right, once again, that final score, 27-20. Creekside picks up the win over the Westlake Lions. Nikwai Lett, quarterback for the Seminoles with two touchdowns, one in the air, one in the ground. Seminoles off to a 2-0 start for the season. From Creekside High School in Fairburn, Georgia, I'm Damian Lewis with Press Force Nation.